I know my bed's a mess, but bold of you to assume that I have my life together at all times of the day. So just don't look at it. Hey, what's up? Hello. We all have celebrity crushes. Either you're embarrassed to say it, or it's just not a popular person that everyone's into. But I'm here to let you know that my celebrity crush is the one and only Jackson Wang from GOT7. That is the husband that I've always wanted, the father of my unborn children, and the man I would literally do anything for. And if you don't follow me on Twitter, probably didn't know that and I just I just came to the earth-shattering conclusion that I don't know if Jackson and I are compatible so to find out if Jackson really is the man for me I thought today I would take a test to see which member of God 7 is actually my soulmate this may not seem like a lot to you but it's a lot to me so let's do it so the first question is you want to buy a couple outfit with your boyfriend what color do you choose the options are red pale blue gray blue black and white okay mm. my favorite color is red but more specifically it's burgundy and i have seen jackson rock red and burgundy and it literally makes me want to vomit every time i see him because he looks so good so i am gonna say red you're having a date what would you want to do? The options are listen to music together, go skateboarding, it must be fun, take a walk together, go to karaoke, watch a movie, I want him to play the piano for me, go dance somewhere. Bold of you to assume that I go outside. If we're going to choose something, I feel like, okay, I mean, I listen to music by myself all the time. So, I mean, that's, you know, not going to be so exciting. Take a walk together. I love walks, especially like at night or, you know, if you're going to the beach and you want to take in the scenery, that's really cute. Um, karaoke is always fun because, you know, not everybody takes karaoke seriously. Um, watching a movie is fine, along with cuddling, that's fun. And go dance somewhere. I don't have rhythm and I can't dance, so I don't want to embarrass myself. So if I'm going to have to pick one, I think I'd say probably go karaoke because that is really funny when you go with your friends and it's not taken seriously so karaoke he wants to watch a movie with you what movie do you have in mind the options are eternal sunrise i don't know what that is any movie will do no miracle in cell number seven don't know what that is the simpsons i'd rather die a horror movie frozen never again in my life a romance or a comedy i am a horror junkie and if you don't know that about me now you know so i'm gonna have to say a horror movie he invited you to dine out. What food do you order? Pizza, Sam, grilled pork belly, hamburger, Korean soft spicy tofu stew, dim sum, everything it's okay, but no cucumbers. <laughs> oh, Yonje, stop. Let's not come for Yonje, okay? He's entitled to his opinion. Tom Yum, a Thai seafood soup. Okay, so <clears throat> here's the thing. I had a college phase where I ate pizza all the time, so the sight and smell of it makes me want to hurl myself out of a window. So I'm gonna have to pass on that. I rarely eat pork, so um, no. Sondu, uh, whatever that is, Korean soft spicy tofu stew. Here's the thing, y'all. I tear up when I eat hot Cheetos. I don't know how spicy this is gonna go, so I'd rather just avoid it at all costs. So in all honesty, the one thing that I would really like to try is dim sum, which is Chinese dumplings. What's your favorite weather slash season? Winter, windy, humid, rainy, autumn, fall, summer, or spring? I like spring because it's a good mix of cold and hot, like you get warm days and then like it's cooler at night and there's a nice breeze and it's sunny outside. Well, not right now because LA is just going through something. I don't know what it is, Jesus, but it's been gray every other day. But I promise you it's not like that all the time but I'll have to pick spring. I think spring is fun. What's your personality? Someone with who he would be able to joke around with, quiet, extroverted, someone equally as loud and someone who gives him a hard time, elegant and cheerful, someone who can make him laugh when he's upset and someone who always supports him, someone very fun and extroverted with a serious but playful personality, someone who isn't too goofy and knows when to be serious, someone who is mature, more introverted than extroverted is someone who is quiet when they need to be but can also be social if needed. I would have to say someone very fun and extroverted with a serious but playful personality. That's definitely me because I am very out there. I do like to make people laugh. I do like to hang out and, you know, be social. But I can be serious and I do have a very playful personality so I've got to choose that. And I think this is the last one. What is your boyfriend's charm? 
he's nice and caring, he's sweet and handsome, he has a great body, he's funny, always making me laugh, he's cool, he's smart and understanding, he's wild and sexy. Honestly, Jackson is all of those things, but the closest thing I can get to is wild and sexy. He really, really is, okay? So, God, that is the last question. Okay, I gotta choose this wisely. Okay, I'll say he's wild and sexy, because that's what I think. Your boyfriend is Mark. You know what? He's like, he's my bias too. So I'll take it. Let's let's see why Mark is my boyfriend. Mark, sweet boyfriend. Your God7 boyfriend is Mark, the visual of God7 and a fellow LA native. Hey, what's up? Hey. He would be super sweet and do little things for you. For example, if you'd have a pile of dirty dishes, he would do them for you and would go out and buy some flowers for you to cheer you up in case you were having a bad day. I'm pretty sure Jackson will do the same thing, but like go off Mark, I guess. This isn't what I wanted. <laughs> but like, it's fine because I love Mark and he's a fellow LA native, so I will let that slide. But now we're gonna see if our signs are compatible, Jackson and I. So let's do some research, shall we, kitty girls? Hey Siri. When was Jackson Wang born? Jackson Wang was born March 28th, 1994 and is 25 years old. Oh yeah! So we're gonna input that information with my birthday, which is January 25th, 1998. Yes, I know he's older than me, I don't care. We're gonna see if Jackson and I are even meant to be or if our signs are meant to clash and fall apart. I'm really hoping not because I can't handle that. Oh my God, guys, this is what it says. <coughs> <clears throat> when an Aquarius and Aries come together, there is a high love compatibility that fuels life into this union. There is a very compatible match between the fixed air sign of Aquarius and the cardinal fire sign of Aries. As two very energetic signs, this is an energetic relationship that is always in motion. Oh <laughs> yeah? Aries will love the out of the box ideas that Aquarius brings to the table. Aquarius loves how Aries goes after things and the creative and passionate approach that Aries brings to the table. This is a match with excellent sexual chemistry as well, as these two will keep each other going in love for as long as the stars allow. <laughs> in this match, we have the fixed air sign of Aquarius pairing with the cardinal fire of Aries. This makes for a very lively combination, as air and fire help each other grow. Oh heck yeah, I'll help you grow, Jackson, oh yeah! Aquarius brings a unique perspective that is out of the box that Aries is really attracted to. Uh, I mean, <laughs> Aries, on the other hand, has a very fiery drive to try out almost anything. I mean, we see that he's the brand ambassador for everybody and their mother, so. I just want to say thank you, Jesus. You know what? That's all I need to know is that we are actually compatible. That's all that matters. Well, now I know that Jackson and I are compatible, but apparently my soulmate is Mark. In conclusion, Jackson and I are meant to be. But yeah, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure to give this video a big ol' thumbs up. That helps me out so much. Also, don't forget to subscribe for brand new videos every single week. Also, click that bell so you don't miss out whenever I post. And if you want to follow me on all my social media, they'll be linked right down below and they'll be on the screen. So you have no excuse to not follow me. Until I see you guys again next time, I will catch you on the flip side. Peace out. Make good decisions. Jackson is my boyfriend. So hands up!